Hey what's up YouTube and welcome back to another CD8 Weeks video as far as we receive a new jailbreak and I'm talking here about the Uncover and the Chimera jailbreak starting from iOS 11 up to 12.4 so let's go ahead to share with you guys some tweaks for that new jailbreak before i'm gonna be start today's video let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up also make sure to subscribe hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever i release a new seed yet week's video all right so let me go ahead right now to start talking about the first one and the first one it's gonna be called the avalancy so let me go ahead right now and jump under the settings here first of all let me show you guys the uh, tweak what is going to be provide you with so let me go back here you can take a look right now here at the bottom that animation once you want to scroll down or scroll up just like that this is how it's going to be the tweak will be provide you with if i want to go ahead right now and jump under the settings so here we are right now under the settings and you need to enable the tweak and all those kind of uh, stuff that we have right now here under the settings i highly suggest you guys leave it as the same so once you download the tweak the only change that you need to do to just respring your device so your device will be take the effect and then you can see your apps your tweaks everything that you have under the settings it looks like that animation on it once you want scroll down between all the page here so this is what the tweak pretty much will be provide you with. And as I told you guys, this one will be called Evalency. Let me move on right now to talking about the next one. And the next one will be called the Hood Customizer. So pretty much this will be customized the whole style of that hood. You can make it big, you can make it smaller, you can bring some animation to it. You can take a look right now here. How is my hood set to be looks like? Let me show you guys once again. This is how it's gonna be looks like. If I want to jump right now under the settings here. So the first thing that you need to do to enable the tweak. Also, we have some other stuff if you want to go through uh, it's gonna be up to you one of these things if you want to change the position for your hood if you want to color the background if you want to change some style once you're done from all those configuration you need to make sure to respring your device so your device will be take the effect and this is the way about that tweak once again if you guys are looking to download this one this one will be called the hood customizer moving right now to the next one and the next one will be called the blue board this one will be make your keyboard it comes with a blue color here you can take a look right now that my keyboard it didn't take that whole color that's because i download some tweaks one of them is going to be the little xs uh my keyboard is two different colors but basically once you download this one this one will be changed the whole color for your keyboard with the blue color this is what pretty much the tweak will be provide you with and once again if you guys looking to download this one this one will be called the blue board moving right now to talking about the next cd tweak and the next one will be called the border icon plus so you can take a look right now here about my spring board and how is the icons with that border which is it looks really beautiful in my opinion so this is what the tweak will be provide you with even we have some other stuff under the settings if you want to go through so pretty much you have more than toggle here go ahead and read each single section is going to be what for so one of them is going to be for your apps for your folder every single thing that you need to do in your apps one of these things here let me show you guys here's my apps here let me show you guys one of my folders so here is one of my folders here right now comes with a border here you can take a look it is really beautiful also if you want to change the color for the border it is available from under the settings as i told you guys once you're done from all the configuration you need to make sure to re-spring your device so your device will be take the effect and this is the way about that week once again if you guys looking to download this one this one will be called the border icon plus let's go ahead right now to move on to the next cd tweak and the next one will be called the dots so basically once you download this one this one will be came as a dots once you receive any kind of notification so 
basically let me just go through some details here from under the settings first of all go ahead and enable the tweak also on if you want to toggle that on your lock screen also if you want to top to wake your device we have here at the bottom two different kind of sliders if you want to adjust the way of that dots in your lock screen let me show you guys right now the way how is the dot well will be looks like once you receive a notification so let me just right now lock my device using my other device send a message here and then you can take a look right now how is that dots will be pop up in your lock screen so there you go right now you can take a look here that the dot is already that's mean i already received a message let me just uh, send another one you can see right now here that i already received a, another message here and this is what the dots will be looks like in your lock screen anyway if you guys uh, want to install this one so uh, this dots will be different so for example if you receive a uh, message from facebook the dots will be blue so based on the app color from reddit will be uh, orange or twitter it will be different anyway so this one will be called if you want to download it dots so anyway guys this is the most tweak that i want to share with you guys in today's video so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video don't forget give the video a huge thumbs up and also make a short subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever i release a new video catch you with the next one peace